Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about adding positive and negative numbers, and we're going to find each sum. Now, this one's tricky. There's a fraction here. We have 5 uh, five thirds, not 5.3, 5 thirds plus a negative 7 fifths, okay? So, <clears throat> when I add these two numbers together, I need to have a common base, right, a common denominator. So, 3 and 5 are not common denominators. But I know that both 3 and 5 go into 15. 3 goes into it 5 times, and 5 goes into 15 3 times. So what I'm going to do is take 5 thirds and multiply it by uh, uh, 5 fifths. Because 5 over 5 is just, is just 1. And I'm going to take this negative 7 fifths and multiply it by 3 thirds. Okay? So essentially I'm just multiplying both sides here by 1, and any number times 1 is itself. But this allows me to have a new common denominator, uh, or a common denominator, not a new one. So 5 times 5, right, we multiply across the numerator is 25, and 5 times 3 is 15. So what that tells us here is that 25 fifteenths is the same fraction as 5 thirds. So then we're adding a, uh, well, negative 7 fifths, multiply by 3 across negative 7 times 3 is negative 21, and 5 times 3 is 15. And now we succeeded because we have the same base. That's what we wanted, a common denominator. So now that we have a common denominator, we can add these two fractions. Okay? And when we add the fractions, the, common, the denominator is still the same. And we add across the numerator. Well, 25 plus a negative 24, or subtracting 24, is just 4. And so 4 fifteenths would be my final answer. I can't simplify it anymore. So again, <clears throat> I'll start from the beginning. We had 5 thirds and negative 7 fifths. We needed to find a common denominator. I took 5 thirds and multiplied by 5 over 5. Right? 5 over 5 being 1. And I took negative 7 over 5 and times by 3 over 3. How I got these numbers is I knew that 3 and 5 both went into 15. Well, 5 times, uh, or 5 fifths times 5 thirds is 25 over 15. We multiply across the numerator and the denominator. And negative 7 over 5 times 3 thirds is negative 21 over 15 for the same reasons. We add them together, we keep the denominator the same when we add fractions, but the numerator we deal with. All right? So the, the base is the same. All right? We just leave it alone, we just add the numerator. 25 plus negative 21 is 4, and so 4 fifteenths is my final 